not more than 24 hours, the Chinese ambassador to Nigeria came out to tell Nigerians that it cost them 2 million US dollars to bring in their medical team to Nigeria to come and assist Nigeria. That the Nigerian government requested for them to come over. The value of the equipment, uh, medical supplies, is around 1.5 million US dollars. And including the other costs, like the chartered air flight, it's all uh, around 2 million US dollars. The same people that they said they spent 2 million US dollars to bring in medical teams, Chinese, from China to come and assist Nigeria. You guys do not believe the kind of video that is coming out from China. The Nigeria Consular General to China had a heated argument confronting some of the Chinese officials on the kind of treatment that is being meted on Nigeria citizens over there in China as we speak. You guys should watch for yourself. You'll be popular. Yes, no you'll problem. Be, you'll be popular. No problem. You'll be popular too. I'm a diplomat agent. Yeah, you'll be popular. Yes, I'm a diplomat agent. In line with the Vienna Convention of 1963, yes, the consular has the right to protect its nationality. What we are doing this night is to protect all our Nigerian nationality. They are not a criminal. They are not anything. Why are you harassing them? These are the things we want to know. Who so, are you are arresting them. Who arrested? You are arresting them. If you are arrested, I will tell you that you are arresting them. Oh, who arrested? They are, they are police. Your police. Oh, who arrested? Your your police. Who? Because they are going to your house. We have, we have the videos. We have the evidence. Uh, you mean you mean arrest? Arresting, arresting, humiliating them. Harassment, harassment, harassment. You are arresting them. Yes. Oh. Because go to their houses, <laughs> lock their door, come out. Yeah, Nigeria. Nice, nice, nice. 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 I don't need to talk to him. If anybody wants to talk to me, you should come here. Nice. I don't talk to anybody. <laughs> I don't talk to anybody. <laughs> and then you do mention to me mm -hmm. at the last meeting that I have with you yeah. that they are going to treat them free of charge without collecting any money from them. In the, in the hospital, or... Nigerians, Shebuna Dosiam. God has started exposing them. Good Samaritans. They spent 2 million US dollars to bring in Chinese into Nigeria. But they are maltreating Nigeria citizens over there in China. They are not taking good care of them. You guys have seen it for yourself. These people, they have not told us the real reason why they came over to Nigeria. They have not said it. But God has started exposing them. Less than 24 hours that they came into Nigeria. Look at what is happening. Look at the feedback that we are getting from China. God bless that Nigeria Consular General for having the courage in confronting them and putting out this video for the world to see. Because I truly don't know what those Chinese people came to do in Nigeria. I truly don't know. Because even the daughters on ground, they said we don't need them. We don't want them to come. We don't need the assistance. They insist that they must come in. That they were invited by the Nigerian government. No problem. You guys cannot be so good. You cannot be so generous. You leave your country. You go through all the stress. You spend your resources. That you are coming over to Africa, Nigeria. To come and assist Nigerians. But meanwhile, Nigerian citizens that are over there in China. You guys are maltreating them. And you think we are stupid? Maybe. Because of the way they see the kind of people we call leaders in Nigeria. The Nigeria government. So they feel we are all dumb. We don't have sense. You guys have not told us what people came to do in Nigeria. Your real mission, you guys have not told Nigerians yet. But we will sit down and watch as things unfold. No problem. But one thing I want Nigerians to know. God has started exposing them.